What's up everybody, this is Big Ox Triple Six here. And back in the 90s, Sega were, were an awesome, awesome company. Awesome company. They made the Sonic series. One, two, three, Sonic and Knuckles. Sonic 2 is my favorite. Um, they made Vector Man. They made um, Golden Axe. Freaking Shinobi, the Shinobi series. One, two, and three. The third one's great. I love the third one. Streets of Rage, one, two, and three. If you never played Streets of Rage 2, you need to play that game. If you like like beat 'em ups, Streets of Rage 2 is a great, great game. And ever since the Dreamcast, they they went freaking downhill. Totally downhill. I got something on my face. Blah. Yeah, they totally went downhill and stuff. I think it was um Sonic Adventure. The first one for the Dreamcast. Uh, after that, what game? What Sonic game was it? Um, Sonic the Hedgehog. I remember that one. That one, oh my god, that one was horrible. I mean, they made some good games after Sonic Sonic the Hedgehog. Um, if you never played Sonic Colors, that game's great. Um, Sonic. Sonic uh, All-Stars Racing, that game was awesome, totally awesome. I know I'm saying a bunch of Sonic games, but they mostly made, made a bunch of Sonic games. Sonic and, and Mario. I never played those games. I'm not going to try to because it's not my type of thing. But Sonic Colors, uh, Sonic Generations, you that if you like old school Sonic games, yeah, Sonic Generations, play that one. Um, but also... I never played The Lost World. I really want to play that one, but I wait to the price drop and also the abysmal Sonic Boom. <laughs> wow, that, that game was horrible. <laughs> horrible. But anyways, besides the point, Sega, the CEO of Sega has finally admitted a betrayal of trust. And the studio is finally Hope well, I say hopefully, aiming to build a high quality console games again. Hopefully, because they pretty much been closing down a bunch of their studios. And I'm gonna read the quote that they said if my computer would stop acting up. Okay. Sega seeks to rebuild its name and reputation, and this means a refocus on quality when it comes to console games. This is one, one of the, the statements they said. We did our best to build a relationship of mutual trust with our older fans of Sega, like myself. But looking back, there has been some titles that have partially betrayed that in the last 10 years. Yeah. Sonic Boom. <laughs> Sonic Boom. Sonic the Hedgehog. Sega was known for its brand, but after that, we have lost trust and we are left with nothing but reputation. That's, yeah, that's all you guys have. For this reason, we like to win back the customer's trust and become a brand once again. I've been talking to the employees about how we should start putting serious consideration into into quality from this point on, especially North America and Europe, where it's always been more of a focus on my computer's not working. Don't you don't you just hate a computer that it doesn't like work properly for you? <laughs> Anyways, I'm off the subject. Um, where it's always been more of a focus on schedules. I believe that if we can't maintain a quality, it would be better not to release the thing at all. They're actually using their heads. A company's actually using their heads. <laughs> I, I, I think I'm gonna shed a tear. Just, just, nah, not really. I'm gonna give, give two craps. If Kong, Kong, get Kong, Kong, Capcom actually use their heads and 
not be obsessed with DLC and ripping people off with di like this base DLC. You guys know what I'm talking about. Street Fighter vs. Tekken. Marvel vs. Capcom 3. You guys know what I'm talking about. But Sega, I'm going to give a little bit of props, but I have to see what you're going to do. I really can't say, oh yeah, I'm, I'm, I'm awesome about this. You got you can you can talk the words, but you got you got act. Uh, uh, that sounds horrible. You guys know what I mean. <laughs> you guys know what I'm saying. Um, but yeah, if they do do a good job, bravo, kudos. Because I really don't want them to go to mobile gaming. I really don't. I played one of their one of their mobile games, Sonic Rush, for quite some time actually, and it was the same thing over over again. I was just like meh for for actually a whole month and I don't know why I don't know why I was playing it actually to be honest now I think about it but um I'm just mumbling on right now but yeah I'll leave the article in the description below like usual but anyways that's all I have to say about this if you like the video give it a thumbs up if you didn't you know, give it a thumbs down. Leave your comments in the comment section below. Like always, I will respond back to you guys. And also, share my videos. And don't forget to subscribe. But anyways, guys, this is Big Ox 666. And I'm signing out.